Hello everyone. This is a quick video for you about the, because of the way these newer washers are because of all the electronics that are in washers these days and how to try to help protect your investment a little bit. As we all know, washers today, dryers, stoves, everything these days always seems like they have some kind of electronic electronics on them and essentially they're basically like a rudimentary computer because these control boards like these on uh, on these machines basically control every aspect of the wash cycle and tells it tells it what wash cycle it's on and how long uh, all the sensors connect to it to tell the washer what it's doing if it needs to add more water where it's at in the cycle and all that kind of stuff even even the dryers these days have, have electronics in them uh, one thing I strongly recommend these days with these machines because of the sensitive electronics that are in them is uh, you should consider getting yourself a, uh, a surge protect some kind of surge protection for your uh, for your machines now I have this is the one I have for for my washers these two here go to the main washer main washer inside the little pedestal washer that I have But I have this set up that way I protect my machines from uh, power surges. But one one problem that we have these days is be with with these electric dryers is they usually run with uh, the big plug because they usually require 220 volts to operate. The problem is they don't usually make uh, surge protection for. Uh, for 220 lines like that not that not that you can plug in like this if you have a you have a gas dryer you'd be just fine with one of those one of these these kind but for the 220 line I have uh, I have that guy a little black box that sticks out the side of the uh, my circuit breaker panel what that is that's a whole house surge protector this 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 guy protects the whole entire house including my 220 volt stuff but if you Let's try not to fall off my steps because my breaker back panels and uh, goes up in the steps there. But because of all the sensitive electronics on things today, I strongly recommend getting a cert some kind of surge protection for your equipment in one form or another. Especially because these things aren't cheap, and then uh, if, so, if a uh, surge knocks out the out part of the computer board in these machines, it can cost an arm and leg to fix them. I'm not saying that surge protectors can protect from every from everything, but. Uh, But anything you can do to protect your investments like these is a good thing. Especially in this day and age with if you you're in an area where the power is constantly flicking on and off, on and off, or uh, if you're in an area with bad power altogether. I seriously uh, suggest that you get one of these for your... Uh, for your machines, all your electronic equipment, and so on. 
but that's my advice to you to help protect your uh, expensive, especially expensive equipment. You can take it for, uh, you can take my advice for what you will. Get, get one for your equipment if you want to protect it. Otherwise, oh well. So, but that's just my uh, friendly advice to you. I hope this was helpful. Thank you for watching. God bless. So long.